going on guys? So today we are back with another Pokemon Masters video and today we're actually going to be continuing on with a few sync pair stories here. Uh, so we do have Will and Karen coming up today and uh, we will be doing a sync pair scout of course like we always do at the end of every video. So let's actually see what Will and Zatu are up to here. Check out what they're doing. As Atticus was wandering the town, she felt like someone was calling her. Looking around, she noticed Will and Zatu standing there. Hey, Atticus, come over here. Hee <laughs> hee, <laughs> all according to plan. Plan? I see that my psychic powers reached you. I thought this would be a great opportunity for us to be more acquainted with each other. So I set up this meeting so we could chat. I thought, that I might need your help in order to become stronger. But you're so strong already. I thought so too, but I was wrong. <laughs> I trained vigorously in order to become a member of the Elite Four, and at last I was able to become one. I was confident that no one but the champion could defeat me. But one day, a random trainer was able to defeat me easily. I was much weaker than I had thought. Shall we? That is why I want to find new power at the PML. I want to defeat that trainer with that All power. Right. I shall show you how I am training to do so. Look into Zatu's eyes. It is said that Zatu is gazing at both the past and the future, <laughs> but looking into her eyes and you can feel like you're able to predict what will happen in battle. <laughs> well? I, I don't see. feel a thing. Well, that's strange. Well, this is a predicament. I thought you'd be able to feel something, but... What? Hmm? What's wrong, Zatu? <gasps> What is this power? Oh. Atticus, look into her eyes again. <laughs> did you feel it too? Like the cheers and excitement of thousands of people? I did. That might be our future. A vision of us facing each other at the PML. At last, that is how I interpreted it. <laughs> As I thought, I needed you. As two trainers who were gifted with a vision of Zatu, <laughs> let's keep moving forward toward that future. What? Hmm. No, you shouldn't stare into her eyes too long. You might accidentally see the results of our battle. That would take the fun out of it, wouldn't it? Well, maybe we'll be able to forecast the future, but it is up to us to be able to pave the way to it. I'm looking forward to our future. That's a really cool, like, detail about Zatu. I didn't actually know that. I wonder if that's, like, straight from the Pokedex entry. Okay, let's actually check out what Karen and Houndoom are up to. As Atticus was walking down a city street, she noticed Karen and Houndu just walking ahead of her. She opened her mouth to call out to them, but at the exact same moment, they turned around to face her. <laughs> ah, I had a feeling it was you. I sensed your presence coming closer to me. You didn't seem very vigilant, though. You should never let your guard down. Understood. Sure. Good answer. Uh-oh, there's a loose piece of thread hanging down from your clothes there. Suddenly, Houndoom let out a small steam of fire, just big enough to burn away the stray thread. There, all gone. <sighs> you still don't get it, do you? Mm -hmm. If my intentions had been malicious instead of helpful just now, you'd already be reduced to a pile of cinders. That's why I told you, you can't afford to let your guard <clears> down. <throat> you need to be fully aware, right down to the seams of your clothes. Bad people will invent all sorts of reasons to approach you. <laughs> Good to know. Hmm, you're good at adapting, aren't you? You're determined to grow and improve, but you're flexible too. I kind of like that, especially since Houndoom and I can't really relate. You don't yes. adapt and change? No, we don't. To live life following the advice of others, that just wouldn't be in our nature. <laughs> Likewise, we don't stop anyone else from doing what they want to do either. That being said, you should still straighten up the appearance and try not to give your opponent an opening. Uh -huh. Besides, if you possess true, genuine power, you won't need to change yourself anyway. That makes um, sense. I have noticed one thing, though. When Houndoom howls, most people and Pokemon can't help but quiver in fear. But since we've been talking, I haven't seen you react that uh -huh. way at all. You must have some serious guts, or else somehow be perfectly at <laughs> ease. More than likely, it's both. So sorry. sorry, forget about what I said earlier, all right? You're strong in your own way. Yes. Trainers like you should battle with whatever Pokemon they want and however they wish. You have your own way of doing things, and so Try do I. I hope someday we can see how our difference measure up in battle. 
I'll be looking forward to it. Cool, cool. All right, so let's actually head over and we'll do our sync pair scouting here. And we are working our way through these sync pair stories. So hopefully these will take us all the way through into, uh, into launch here. I believe they will. I believe there should be plenty. All right, so since we already used our daily discount in a previous video, we are gonna do our regular sync pair scout here. Uh, like I say, every single video, we are still on the hunt for uh, Brandon or we would like Agatha. Those are the two that I'm like really looking for right now. So see what we got. At, at least not a dupe. Can we please just not get a dupe? So we've got the propellers, no antenna. So three star looking like, what do we got for our doors? Uh-huh, four star doors. My okay, that's uh, at least not I'm a dupe. Uh, we do have Grant and columns. Amora there. I climb any wall in front of me. All right, so let's actually check out what is in Grant's kit here. So he is a rock type attacker. Uh, he is a special attacker. No, sorry. He is a tech. So rock tomb and rock slide there. Uh, rock slide's actually not that bad. Uh, X special defense. That could actually be kind of interesting um, for Pokemon that already either have a really high special defense or Pokemon that hurt their own special defense like Lucario. That could actually be a nice uh, little addition to that type of team. So increase the user's move gauge by two. Very, very important uh, skill there. Raises the user's accuracy and makes the user gradually heal itself. Holy cow. Okay, so that's actually not that bad. Uh, in terms of passives, holy cow, protects the Pokemon from damage in a hailstorm. Interesting. Uh, protects from damage in a sandstorm and raises the chance of inflicting the flinching, confused or trapped condition with an additional effects of boost. Okay, so that's actually not too bad. Uh, with a weakness to steel, there's not too many steel type moves rolling around out there. Um, Thornton is the only one that comes to the top of my mind. So that's actually not too bad. Well, that could actually be a decent tech roll. Kind of could be a placement for possibly Brock uh, with Onyx. Um, not necessarily uh, kind of going to fit the same shoe as Tyranitar. So that could actually be kind of interesting. As long as it's not a dupe, I'm super happy with it. So uh, that is actually going to be it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out. Thank you so much for watching. As always, remember the Discord is down in the description below. And as always, I'll go ahead and play those ending credits for you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, always remember that if you like to like videos, you could do that, but if you don't, you could be that guy. Otherwise, uh, let me know what you have to say down in the comments below about the video. I do highly appreciate you guys watching. If you guys want to support me in any way, there are several links down in the description for Patreon, uh, joining the community here on YouTube, or even just directly PayPal if that's your thing. I greatly appreciate everyone's name that's on screen as you guys have showed some sort of support outside of just viewing the videos. And I thank you guys, you, you don't understand from the bottom of my heart. So until our next video guys, I will catch you then.